guys, I'm Michelle Wright with the CowWhispersCreativeCards.com and today we're going to create this masculine birthday card from the Nature Sing stamp set which is actually in our holiday catalog right now. I wanted to showcase this set again because obviously this is not just a Christmas set and we're going to do a lot of tone on tone here and I think you're gonna love it. Super simple card, but I love the way it looks. So let's go ahead and set that aside and let's get started. As always in the top in the eye, in the right hand corner, you're going to find a link directly back to my blog post with all the measurements. So you don't need to worry about writing any of that down. And it will also be in the description of this YouTube video along with all the supplies I use for you to purchase if you would like. So we're gonna start off our base of our card is crumb cake. And then I chose a piece of our wood textures paper, tons to choose from in that pack, and I love it. It's a different one than I used over here in this one. The decisions were hard. And then I've got Whisper White for my actual card that I'm going to do. And I've got some of our copper foil and another piece of Whisper White. So let's go ahead and we're gonna be using chocolate chip. So let's bring that in. And in this one, I stamped my elk or caribou, whatever it is to you, first. And this time, I think I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to stamp my trees first. So let's go ahead and get, get that going with our chocolate chip. And I'm just going to be random. Some of them off the page. I like them just kind of all over the place. Alrighty, I'm liking that. And then I'm also, if you notice down here for the happy birthday, what I did was that's where I took the uh, piece of very vanilla. And I also did the same thing with that. But I didn't want it to be as dark as the happy birthday. So I stamped off and then on. Off and then on. And I'm overlapping and I'm not making them, you know, precise and none of that. I want it to look all different. I think we've got that pretty good. Let me put one more up here. All right, and while we've got that out, let's just go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and put our happy birthday on there. Now we'll tell you that the happy birthday came from the Guy Greeting stamp set. I love the masculine look, obviously, of everything in that. Ooh, that's a little crooked. But guess what? Because we stamped it first, I can straighten that out, no problem. Guy Greeting. You get all of these, the Guy Greeting. Okay? So, let's see, before we go any further, let's bring in our punch. And you see how I can still can get that pretty straight in there a little bit more looky there see how I had that flexibility see how I had to actually cut it crooked that's why I like to stamp and then punch if at all possible okay so let me go ahead while I've got that punch out and let's just go ahead and punch out our copper And then we'll set that aside and put that together in a minute. Okay, while we've got our ink out here, now let's go ahead and let's do our big elk first. I'm calling it an elk. I'm sure it's a caribou. This farm girl doesn't see elk and caribou, okay? I see cows and deers. In Oklahoma, we see cows and deers. So I'm going to bring that. Let's see. Let's do this one. Hmm, hmm, hmm. You know what? I'm going to put him over here. Loving that. Okay, now let's bring in our deer in the background. Let me ponder on it for a minute. Where do I want to put them? Do I want to put them up here? Like they're in the background back here. Hmm, decisions, decisions. 
I could put them up here. I could put them over. I'm going to put them over here. Put them over here and see what we get. Ooh, I like that. Yes, I do. Okay. Now, I have not used yet, and I've had it. You know how you hoard things that you love? This is the copper trim, and you can actually stretch this out. But I'm just going to put a piece of that across his feet. Let's see. Since I stamped these a little different, let me go ahead and cut this in half. It's our copper. Just grab our fast fuse, and we're just going to put just a little bit of fast fuse on it. Oops. Well, it would help if I put it on the right side. Well, we'll need it here in a minute. Let's put it on our tag. Turn it around. And the way I find that it works the best is just put this edge up against your thumb with this edge up against your thumb. And then you're going to be right, right on the money. See how there? You're pretty good to go then. Let's do it again. Put it right up against your thumb. Slide that one up against your thumb. I want about the same amount of distance, obviously. Okay. So we've got that done. Now what am I going to do? You know what? I may put that up there. Which if I put that up there, I need some more trees. Yep. How do you like that? Don't be afraid to just go with it, you know? If you're feeling it, go with it. They're handcrafted cards, remember. Stamp that off. And stamp this off. And I'm going to do just a couple more down here. All right. Liking that. Now, I also, while I had this out, I wanted it to really look weathered, masculine. So I'm grabbing my chocolate chip sponge. Now, you know I use my daubers a lot of time, but I want this just to be really thick. I want a lot of it on there. So that's why I'm using my sponge versus my dauber. Hold that paper tight. And you're going to get your best results. Okay. Of course, I like those corners heavier. You guys know that. All right. I'm liking that. Okay. I think we can put this away and let's put this thing together. Let's grab us a piece of our copper trim. And you know what? This one, I think I'm going to do, I'm going to just tie a little knot. I didn't do that on the other one because I had this down here at the bottom. But let's grab that. You know how I like to tie my knots. And then you guys are going to see how this kind of will fray out just a little bit on the edges. So I'm just grabbing my spritzer bottle, tying a knot. Come back, tie a knot, sliding it off. Just that simple, okay? And then let's flip this over. Put us just a tiny bit of fast fuse down here. Can grab my copper. Isn't that gorgeous? We're gonna see what I'm talking about here in just a minute with it fraying. Stick that on there and I want to keep it flat. And even which am i off a little i think i'm off just a little and i can't be having that you guys know me i'm not having i'm not having it off centered that ocd will not allow that okay do that and that okay looks pretty good now let's go ahead it's more fast fuse down Go right over your ribbon. Some sticky stuff. You guys know I love my fast fuse. Okay. Let's put that on here. Centering it up pretty good. And let's go ahead and put this down. 
on top of our crumb cake card base. Then I'm going to show you There we go. Now let's take our snips and snip this at an angle. And if you look, see how this kind of pulls apart? You know, it almost looks like copper. For a man, they may say, oh, that looks like copper wire. And we'd say, what well, sure does, and that's exactly what I was going for. <laughs> Not, but we'll, we'll claim that, okay? Okay, got me a new set of dimensionals that I've just gone in and taken all my backing off of. You know I love to do that. And let's put it up here. Let's pull it down just a little bit. And there you go. How's that for a masculine card? So they're similar but different. Ooh, I love it. Love it, love it. All right. So, remember... The Nature Sings, it's in the holiday catalog. You want to grab this because this is not just a holiday stamp set. You can definitely use these for masculine cards. So I did that, threw in some of our guy greeting cards, and here's what we got. And I'm, I'm loving them, i got to tell you. Pretty happy. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up and uh, subscribe to my channel. I've also linked a couple of more videos I think you might be interested in watching at the end. And if you're looking for an independent Stampin' Up! demonstrator and you live in the United States, I would love to be your gal and sure appreciate your business. I hope you guys have a wonderful day and happy crafting.